Hello you sexy beautiful people, welcome to... I don't... I have no idea what I'm going into. This was one of the games in the list and one of you guys suggested that I should give it a go. And the first thing I see myself... <laughs> I see... Is this. This game is not suitable for children and those who are easily disturbed. What the hell and how is this even possible? I don't care. Individual children's were in a set your impression might have a safe experience. A warning. You agree that you're at least 13 years of age and you consent to your exposure of highly disturbing content. Alright, I don't know what's going on here. Team Salvato. The game is not suitable for children and those who are easily disturbed. Alright, it doesn't look that bad. I don't, I don't know. I'm going to put it on full screen. Yeah, uh, there we go. That worked. Now, uh, I guess that's it. I'm just going to... The game is lagging a little. Is it still recording? Yeah, it's it's still recording. Alright. We're ready for the trip, so let's go! Please enter your name. Uh, this is a firm bitch. Alright, let's go. Hey... I see an annoying girl running. Oh, it's a, it was a girl. <laughs> I'm going to stick with that voice. Uh, the girl said, Yori, my neighbor and my good friend since we were children. You know, the kind of friend you n never see yourself making today, but it just kind of works out because you know each other for so long. We used to talk through and like this with certain around the high school, she will overslept more and more frequently, and I will get tired of waiting up. But if she's going to chase after me like this, I almost feel better off running away. Or I just sigh and I only frown after the cross walking, let's say you catch up to me. Eh, no, uh, excuse me, the, the original voice I gave her. <sighs> uh, <laughs> I overslept again, <laughs> but I caught you this time. <laughs> Maybe, but only because I decided to stop. Oh, that's me. Maybe, but only because I decided to stop and wait for you. Uh, you say that you like, like you were thinking about ignoring me. That's me, Jesus fam. Well, if people stare at you for acting weird, then I don't want them to think we're a couple or something. <laughs> Fine, fine. <laughs> but you did wait for me after all. I guess you don't have it but you me mean if you want to. Whatever you s whatever you say, Sayori. <laughs> we cross the street together and make our way to school. As we draw near, the streets become increasingly speckled with other students making their daily commute. By the way, Jesus FM, have you said any club joined yet? A club? I told you already I'm not really interested in joining any clubs. I've been looking neither. Eh, yeah, that's not true. You told me you will join a club this year. Did I? I'm sure it's possible that I did. It's one of her many conversations where I decently go along with whatever she's going to about. She really likes to worry a little too much about me, and I'm perfectly content just getting my own the average while spending my free time on games and anime. Uh-huh. I was talking about how I'm worried that you won't learn how to socialize or have any skills before college. Your happiness is really important to me, you know? And I know you're happy now, but I die at the thought of you becoming a need in a few years because you're not used to the real world. You trust me, right? <laughs> Don't make me keep worrying about you. Right, alright. I look at field clubs if it makes you happy. No promises, though. Will you at least promise me you'll try a little? Yes, I guess I'll promise you that. Yay. <laughs> what do I let myself get lecture by such careful girl? More than that, I'm surprised I didn't let myself relent her hair. Oh, you're mean, actually. You're a little bit mean. I guess seeing her worry so much about me makes me want to ease her mind a little bit. When she does stir everything inside her head. Alright, the classroom. This is Kelly's day is ordinary server and so before I know it. After I pack up my things, I start blanking the wall looking for an ounce of motivation. Clubs. So he wants me to check out some clubs. I guess I have no choice but to start with the anime club. Hello? Sayori? <laughs> Sayori must have come into the classroom while I was spacing out. I look around and realize that I'm the only left in the classroom. I thought I got you coming out of the classroom but I saw you sitting and spacing out so I came in. Also, you're even worse than me sometimes. I'm impressed. You don't need to wait up for me, so it's going to make you late to your own club. Well, I thought you might need some encouragement, so I thought you know. I need to uh, fucking read right because oh my god, I did it again. I guess I I I made the other boys when I was supposed to do this one. Know what? <laughs> well, you go cop to my club, Sayori. <laughs> yeah. There's no way I'm going to your club. <laughs> uh, mini. <laughs> Sayori is vice president of the literature club. Not that I were aware that she had any interest in, lit in literature. 
In fact, I'm 99% sure she only did it because she thought it would be fun to help start a new club. Since she was the first one to show interest after the one who proposed the club, she inherited the title of Vice President. That said, my Israeli literature is guaranteed to be even less. Yeah, I'm going to the... Uh, uh, yeah, I'm going to the anime club. Come on, please. Why do you care so much, anyway? Well, I'm quite all the closures I will bring you in a new member. And Natsuki can make cupcakes and everything. Hehehe. <laughs> Don't make promises you can't keep. I can't tell if Sayuri really had that much of an airhead or she's cunning as to have planned all of this out. I let a long sigh find a stop by for a cupcake, okay? Yes, let's go. <laughs> and thus, today marks the day I sold my soul for a cupcake. I directly followed Sayuri across the school and upstairs the section of the school or a visit, being generally used for third year classes and activities. Sayuri, full of energy, swings up the classroom door. Everyone, the new member is here. I told you, don't call me a new. I, I, I told you, I don't. <laughs> Damn it! I, I glanced around the room. Uh, what name? What should I? Welcome to the literal club. <laughs> it's a pleasure meeting you. <laughs> Sayuri, girl one, <laughs> girl one. <laughs> Sayuri always says nice things about you. <laughs> oh, she tiny. Say nothing, you better boy. <laughs> Wait to kill the atmosphere. <laughs> ah, just have a, what a nice surprise. Welcome to the club. Ah, we're just get me in this situation. This club is full of incredibly cute girls. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. This is like real basic stuff. Uh, what are you looking at? If you want to say something, say it. Sorry. <laughs> Natsuki. <laughs> Oh, she's, her name is Natsuki, alright. Uh. Hmm. <laughs> the girl with the sour attitude whose name is Brandy Natsuki is one I don't recognize. Her small figure makes me think she's probably a first year. She's also the one who made cupcakes, according to Sayori. You can just ig you can just ignore whenever she gets moody. <laughs> Sayori says that quietly into my ear when then turns back toward the other girls. Anyway, this is, uh, this is Natsuki, always full of energy. And this is Jory, the smartest in the club. And what about the other one? D don't say things like that. Jory Hooper's comparably more mature and timid seems to have a hard time keeping up with the people like Sayori and Natsuki. Oh well, it's nice to meet both of you. And it sounds like you already know Monica, is that right, Monica? Uh, that's right, I've seen her from memes, but I don't understand like the context out of it. Maybe, maybe this will help a little. Uh, uh, I don't know what voice to keep to her because I, I gave her like a different one, but I don't I don't know Maybe I should try like I, I, what I, I I have no idea whatsoever. You know what? I'm going to go with uh, uh, That's right uh, <laughs> It's great to see you again. This is a fan <laughs> like a like a big man So you're a small like a, a like a big strong man and she's like just a regular big man and I'm just a tiny, go tiny guy. There we go. Monica smiles sweetly. We don't know each other well. Well, we really talked, but we were in the same class last year. Monica was really the most popular girl in class. Smart, beautiful, athletic. Basically, completely out of my league. Oh my god. So, having her smile so generally feels a little. You too, Monica. Come sit down, Yusuf. We made room for you at the table so you can sit next to me or Monica. I get the cupcakes. Hey, I made them, so I'll get them. <laughs> See, she's like a fucking. Uh, I don't know, like a fucking goblin? <laughs> Boys? I don't know. S uh, sorry, I got a little too excited. Then how about I make some tea as well? <laughs> the girls have a few desks arranged to form a table. As Sayori mentioned, it's been widened so that there's one space next to Monica and one space next to Sayori. Natsuki and Yuri walk over to the corner of the room where Natsuki grabs a wrapped tray and Yuri opens the closet. Still feeling awkward, I take seat next to Sayori. Natsuki proudly marches back to the table with trying hand. Okay, are you ready? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> Natsuki lifts the foil tray that really doesn't white fluffy cupcakes decorated look a little like little cats. Ah, oh, that's actually cute. The whiskers are drawn with icing and little pieces of chocolate were used to make ears. So cute. I had no idea you were so good at baking, Natsuki. Oh, maybe <laughs> that was that was the worst voice I could give her. I don't know what to give her. 
literally I talk like a robot right there like no maybe I should use like I got no idea they were looking at taking that the key I don't know I don't remember how to use my robot voice maybe I, maybe I should give her something else ah, fuck Monica what should I give you uh... <laughs> fuck I don't know <laughs> I had no idea you... No, that's the voice of Natsuki. Fuck, I don't know what to give her. Uh, should I talk like Spanish with her? No tenía idea de que fueras tan buena cocinando, Natsuki. <laughs> I'm going to talk Spanish with her. I will try to translate every single shit she says. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> just hurry and take one. So he grabs one first and Monica, I follow. It's delicious. So he talks with her mouthful and has ready matched to get icing on her face. I turn the cupcake around my fingers, looking for the best angle to take a bite. Natsuki is quiet. I can help but notice her sneaking glances in my direction. Is she waiting for me to take a bite? I finally bite down, tasting is treating full of flavor. I wonder if she made it herself. This is really good. Thank you, Natsuki. <laughs> oh, she's she's this type of girls. Uh, you know what? I really like her. That's good. That's cool. What? Why are they attacking me? It's not like I... <laughs> Haven't I heard this somewhere before? Mm, fucking stereotype. Uh, what's the name? Sundari? Shit. Uh, yeah, I guess. Made them for you or anything. Uh, I thought you technically said did Sajori said. Well, maybe. <laughs> but not for you, you know? You dummy. <laughs> alright, alright. I give up on Atsuki where the light can dismiss the conversation. Juri returns to the table carrying the tea seat. She carefully places the tea cups in front of each of us before setting down the teapot next to the cupcake tray. You keep a whole tea set in this classroom? Don't worry. The teacher gave us permission. <laughs> I just like, like or orgasmic with her? <laughs> I don't know. After all, doesn't a hot cup of tea help you enjoy a good book? <laughs> what the fuck? That's actually, uh, I, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> no dejes que te intimiden. <laughs> Yuri nada más te está tratando de impresionar. <laughs> uh, that's not. Insulted Yuri looks away. I meant that. Uh, you know. <laughs> I believe you. Well, tea and reading might not be a pastime for me, but at least I enjoy, I enjoy tea. I'm glad. <laughs> Yuri faintly smiles to herself in relief. Monica raises an eyebrow and smiles at me. So what made you consider it a literal... Uh, oh, fuck, it was in Spanish. Um, <laughs> I was afraid of this question. Something tells me I shouldn't tell Monica that I was practically dragged here by Sayori. Well, they haven't joined the club, any clubs yet, and Sayori seemed really happy here, so... Está bien, no te, no te, avergu no te avergüences. Este... <laughs> Nos vamos a asegurar de que te sientas en casa, ¿está bien? Como presidente del club de literatura, es mi deber hacer que el club sea divertido y emocionante para todos. Monica, I'm surprised. How come you decide to start your own club? You could probably be board member for any of the mayor clubs. Weren't you leader of the debate club last year? <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> bueno, sabe. <laughs> para ser honesta, no, no aguanto la política ni <laughs> dentro de los clubs más grandes. Se siente como si... It feels like nothing but arguing. Se siente como si lo único que hiciéramos es discutir y sobre el presupuesto y la publicidad y cómo se preparan los eventos. Prefiero... <laughs> Fuck, I'm translating everything. I would rather take something I personally enjoy and make something special out of it. Preferiría grabar algo que de verdad me gustara y hacer algo especial de ello. Eh... If it encourages... Oh my god, I forgot how to say that in Spanish. Uh, si anima a otros a, a, a adentrarse a la literatura, entonces estoy cumpliendo ese sueño. Monica really is a great leader. <laughs> Yuri yells and nods in agreement. Then I'm surprised there aren't more people in the club yet. It must be hard to start a new club. You could put it... Uh, ¿Lo podrías decir así? No mucha gente está muy interesada en ponerse... <laughs> en poner el esfuerzo de comenzar algo nuevo. Especialmente cuando... Mierda. <risa> eh, es algo que no llama tu atención como la literatura. Tienes que trabajar duro para convencer a la gente que es divertido y que vale la pena. Pero hace que los eventos de la escuela como el festival sean mucho más importantes. Tengo confianza de que podemos crecer y que este club se pueda graduar. 
Ah, ah, no, de que este club pueda crecer antes de graduarnos. Sí. ¿Verdad? ¿Cierto? <ríe> yeah. <ríe> we'll do our best. You know it. You fucking goblin. Uh, everyone does it like Greece. Such a different girls. All interested in the same goal. America must have worked really hard just to find this. Maybe that's why they were all so delighted by the idea of members joining. Though I still don't really know if I can keep up with their level of enthusiasm about literature. So, Jesus FM, what kinds of things do you like to read? Oh, I have a mix-up. Well, uh, considering how little I have read these past few years, I don't really have a good way of answering that. Manga. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's nice, that's great. <laughs> Alright, manga. <laughs> uh, I'm already quiet with myself, half joking. Natsuki head suddenly perks up. It looks like she wants to say something, but she keeps quiet. Not much of a reader, I guess. Well, that can change. What am I saying? <laughs> I, I spoke without thinking after seeing Yuri's sad smile. Anyway, what about you, Yuri? Well, let's see. Judy traces a ring on her teacup with her finger. My favorites are usually novels that build up deep and complex fantasy worlds. <laughs> the level of creativity and craftsmanship behind them is amazing to me. <laughs> and tell a good story <laughs> in such a foreign world is equally impressive. <laughs> Judy goes on clearly passionate about her reading. She seems so reserved and timid since the moment I walk in, but it's obvious by the way her eyes light up that she finds her comfort in the world of books, not people. But you know, I like a lot of things. Stories with deep psychological elements usually immerse me as well. Isn't it amazing how a writer can so deliberately take advantage of your own lack of imagination to completely throw you for a loop? Anyway, I've been reading a lot of horror lately. <laughs> oh, I read a horror book once. <laughs> I just regret something I can relate to at the minimal level. I just read Yuri might as well be having conversation with a rock. En serio, no lo esperaba de ti, Yuri. Por alguna razón, por, para alguien tan gentil como tú. I guess you could say that. <laughs> But if a story makes me think or takes me to another world, then I really can't put it down. Surreal horror is often very successful at changing the way you look at the world, if only for a brief moment. Eh, I hate horror. Oh, why is that? Well, it's just... Natsuki, I start over me for a split second. Never mind. Es cierto, usualmente te gusta escribir sobre cositas lindas, ¿verdad, Natsuki? ¿Qué? <ríe> What? <ríe> What gives you that idea? <ríe> Yo le dejaste un pedazo de papel detrás. Eh, dejaste un pedacito de, de, o sea, un pedazo del papel atrás. No, fuck. Dejaste un pedacito de papel en el último meeting, en el último, en la última reunión. Parecía que estabas trabajando en un poema llamado. Don't say that loud and keep that back. Está bien, está bien. <laughs> your cupcakes, your poems, everything you do is just as cute as you are. Tayri so sidles up behind Natsuki and puts her hands on her shoulder. I'm not cute. Natsuki, you write your own poems? Eh, well, I guess sometimes. Why do you care? I think that's impressive. Why don't you share them sometime? N no. Natsuki averts her eyes. You don't like them, uh, you will unlock them. I'm not very confident writer yet. I understand how Natsuki feels. Sharing that level of writing takes more than just confidence. <laughs> The truest form of writing is writing to oneself. You must be willing to open up your readers, posting your vulnerabilities and showing even the deepest reaches of your heart. ¿Tienes alguna experiencia escribiendo también, Yuri? Tal vez si compartes algunos de tus poemas, este, podemos poner un ejemplo y ahora Natsuki a sentirse más cómoda para compartirlo de ella. <laughs> I guess it's the same for Yuri. Oh, I wanted to read everyone's poems. We all sit in silence for a moment. ¿Está bien? Tengo una idea, todos. Uh, Natsuki and Yuri lose quiz sickly at Monica. Vamos todos a casa, escribimos un poema propio y la próxima vez que nos eh, la próxima vez que nos reunamos, los compartimos cada con, con nosotros. De esa manera, todo queda bien. Todos estamos eh, igual. Um, uh, yeah, let's do it. <ríe> Además, ahora que tenemos un nuevo miembro, creo que nos puede ayudar a sentirnos un poco más cómodos con nosotros. Y ayudar a... 
uh, a fortalecer la unión del club. Es cierto, es un FM. Mónica Mónica smiles warmly at me once again. Hold on, there's still one problem. Eh, ¿Qué es eso? <laughs> ¿Qué problema? Uh, now that we're back to the original topic of me joining the club, I've only come forward with that had been on my mind the entire time. I never said I would join this club. Oh, what a bitch. <laughs> Sayori may have convinced me to stop by, but I never made any decision. I see how other clubs look at and I lose my train of thought. All four girls stare back at me with rejected eyes. Pero... Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, I thought. Hm. Jesus, Jesus, if I'm... Um, you all... I'm defenseless against these girls. How am I supposed to make clear her decision when it's like this? That is, if I'm running points, it's the price I need to pay in order to spend every day with these beautiful girls. Right. Okay, I decided then. I'll join the literal club. One by one, the girls' eyes light up. Yes, I'm so happy. <laughs> Sayuri wraps her arms around me, jumping up and down. Hey, you really did scare me for a moment. If you really just came for the cupcakes, I will be super pissed. Entonces, seas oficial. Bienvenido al club de literatura. Uh, thanks, I guess. Ok, todos. Creo que con eso oficialmente podemos terminar el meeting de hoy con un buen paso. Todos los miembros... Todos, todos recuerden... <ríe> fuck. Todos recuerden la tarea de esta noche. Escriban un poema y tráiganlo para la próxima reunión para compartirlo todos. Mónica looks over at me once more. Es su FM a look... Fuck. Es su FM. Estoy ansiosa para ver cómo te expresas. <laughs> yeah. Can you really impress the class star Monica with my mediocre writing skills? I don't even feel the anxiety welling up inside me. Meanwhile, the girls continue to chit chat as Yuri and Natsuki clean up their food. Hey, she's a fan, since we're already here, did you want to walk home together? That's right, so Yuri and I never walk home together anymore because she always stayed at her school for clubs. Sure, might as well. Yay. With that, the two of us depart the club room and make our way home. This whole way, my mind wanders back and forth between the four girls, Sayori, Natsuki, Yuri, and of course, Monica. We will be really happy spending every day after school in each other's club. Perhaps I'll have the chance to grow closer to one of these girls. Alright, I just need to make the most of my circumstance. And I'm sure good fortune will find me. And I guess I'll start rewriting a poem to tonight. Alright. Ah, uh, it's time to write a poem. Pick words you think your favorite club member will like. Something good might happen. With whoever likes your poem the most. Oh, that's cool. So, is it like... This is cute. Let me tell you that. Wait, and why isn't Monica here? It's like... Is that like... Do I need to do multiple runs? I don't understand. Uh, I'm gonna try something. Uh, um, I guess last is... Yeah, I had the idea. So that means heartbeat should be all right, Natsuki. And games, I guess it's Sayori. It wasn't. So I guess I, this is basically you choosing the girls you want to date. I guess. Uh, so I'm going to go with uh, things. I guess Natsuki because I like Natsuki the most. I'm going to go with her. Uh, so I guess cute, cute, cute rainbow. Are you absolutely shit my ass? All right, uh, smile. What? Uh, cute. That must be it. All right, cute. Kawaii. Uh, vanilla. All right, it's working. It's working. Uh, perfect. Uh, fun. Did it that said suicide? What? Uh, pink. Candy. Uh, beauty, damn it. Um, lipstick, sparkle, kitty, uh, ribbon, skirt, uh, doki doki, <laughs> uh, heart. Well, that was that was great. I guess we got a lot of Natsuki's over there. So you know what? I'm going to finish today's episode here. If you want to see more, just let me know in the comments, and I will be sure to go for it because I actually really like. Interested on in it. <laughs> I, I, I pour my soul into this. And after giving everybody a voice, I'm I'm willing to do a series of this. But so far it's actually taking a really long time. So yeah, let me know if you guys want more of this. And I will be sure to go for it. So thank you guys so much for watching and as always I hope to see you next time.
This is me, Jesus Fam, and I'm out.